Have you ever wondered if God is trying to get your attention? You go about your day, praying occasionally but not really feeling much connection. Deep down you have a longing to know that God sees you and cares. What if I told you there are definite signs God uses to communicate with us if we just open our eyes, ears and hearts? Today I want to share with you five clear signs that God may be trying to get your attention. The first sign is inner peace. Have you ever had a problem or struggle that seemed impossible to solve, only to suddenly feel an overwhelming sense of calm wash over you out of nowhere? This is one of the clearest ways God speaks. When we're anxious or worried about something, God can break through and fill us with a peace that transcends understanding. His peace quiets our doubts and worries and allows us to see solutions we otherwise would miss. This peace comes from God as a sign that He hears us and will provide what we need in His perfect timing. The next time you feel stressed or afraid, but then feel an unexpected peace come over you, take it as a sign from God that He is with you and will take care of the situation in His way. Another sign God may be trying to speak to you is through open doors. We all face closed doors and obstacles in life that seem impossible, but God specializes in opening doors that no man can shut. Pay attention the next time an opportunity arises seemingly out of nowhere that moves you closer to where God wants you. An unplanned meeting, a canceled appointment that frees up your schedule, extra money that comes in right when you need it. These can be signs of God opening doors and placing you exactly where He needs you to be. Don't write off strange coincidences as mere chance. God uses open and closed doors as a way of directing our paths. When you notice doors opening that didn't seem possible before, receive it as a sign from God that He is propelling you forward and making a way where there was no way. A third clear sign God uses to get our attention is inner promptings. Have you ever randomly felt prompted to call or check on a friend, only to find out they needed you in that moment, or felt impressed to stop and help a stranger on the side of the road? These kind of random yet strong urges are often God prompting us to action. When God wants to guide us or use us to bless others, He will plant specific thoughts ideas and even intuitions within our hearts. Pay attention to those aha moments or sudden thoughts about something or someone far from your mind before. God loves prompting our hearts as a way to direct our steps and lead us to where He wants us. When you feel a strong inner nudge to do something out of character, receive it as God speaking and follow through, trusting Him to work through you to bless others. The Bible tells us that God speaks in many ways at various times through dreams, visions, and even natural occurrences. A fourth sign God may be trying to get your attention is through vivid dreams. Pay attention the next time you have an unusually vivid or memorable dream that seems meaningful. God can and does use dreams to reveal insights, guide decision-making, and even warn of danger. Joseph in the Bible received clear direction and saved his family through a series of divinely inspired dreams. Throughout Scripture, we see God revealing prophecies, secrets and plans of the future through symbolic and straightforward dreams. Don't dismiss powerful dream imagery as just your brain processing information. Ponder dreams that stick with you and see more than just random thoughts occurring during sleep. Ask God to reveal what He may be communicating through dream experiences and be willing to obey any clear direction revealed. Lastly, God also speaks through His written word, the Bible. While it may seem obvious a final sign God wants your attention is a deep desire to read His word. The Bible is considered a living book because it is literally God Himself speaking on the pages. When He wants to impart wisdom, reveal truth or convict of sin, God will stir your heart specifically towards certain passages, chapters, and even whole books of the Bible. You may find yourself compelled to study the Bible at times when you never have before. Listen to that prompting and make Bible reading a priority. God will use His written truth to enlighten 
strengthen and transform you from the inside out as you spend time in his love letter to mankind. Let scripture reading take on new meaning, seeing it as a divine appointment of revelation from God himself. When we experience any of these signs, we are wise to pause and discern if God may be communicating a message meant just for us. Prayerfully reflect on what God could be saying through impressions of peace, doors opening just in time, inner urgings to help others, thought-provoking dream symbols or revelations coming alive in scripture passages. Our loving Father longs to draw close to each of his children and speak words individually tailored. In every moment he is finding creative new ways to connect if we open our receptive hearts and minds. The choice is yours whether to acknowledge God's voice or dismiss spiritual experiences as mere coincidence. But so many believers throughout church history testify how their whole lives changed when they started paying attention to the subtle yet powerful ways God speaks. It can mark the beginning of an exciting journey of deeper intimacy where God reveals more of himself in each new sign and its meaning. By becoming aware of common ways he communicates already, your awareness sharpens to new levels of divine connection. Could it be that God has tried getting your attention lately through spiritual promptings you wrote off as unimportant? What if he longs to guide your steps even more closely if you make room for his voice? I encourage you today to be willing be willing to believe in signs from God and let them reshape your perspective. Start each day with heart humility and expectant faith that Father desires speaking directly to his child. You'll begin seeing life unfold in miraculous new ways as your eyes open to spiritual messages everywhere you look and in everything you experience. God wants to have meaningful two-way conversations with his sons and daughters. He doesn't intend for faith to be vague or impersonal, but a living, daily exchange. Bask in his loving nearness by learning to recognize and respond to individual messages he crafts especially for you. Let God's spirit of wisdom and revelation come alive within, illuminating his words through the languages of peace, open doors, inner learnings, dreams, and scriptures. See each sign as a chance to thank God for speaking, listen closely for his perspective, and obey the direction given. With practice, you'll converse heart to heart with the Creator through each sign He sends. Your Heavenly Father is always speaking if we slow down enough to tune our ears, looking for Him moment by moment. Each encounter nourishes your walk intimately as never before. Never doubt God's desire that you hear His encouragement, love and guidance customized just for you. The adventure has only begun when we open our spiritual eyes to recognize signs all around, pointing to a very real divine communicator named God, who knows and sees you completely. His voice awaits your willing response today and each new day ahead. Let's pause in reflection now. What is one insight that stood out to you from this message? Is there a sign you are willing to be more open to recognizing as possibly from God? What one step could you take now to start honing your awareness to see, hear, or feel God's communication in new ways each coming day? I encourage you to make strengthening this spiritual ability of discerning God's messages a priority going forward. Share your thoughts with Him and listen for quiet direction on where to start. He will empower and reward your choice to deepen this divine friendship through each sign He sends. Our loving Creator awaits you, opening your heart fully so His words may fill and strengthen you like never before. Those are the five key signs that God may be trying to get your attention and speak to you personally. To summarize them again, first, inner peace, a sudden overwhelming sense of calm about a worry or problem. Second, open doors, unexplained opportunities that arise at just the right time. Third, inner promptings, strong instincts to do something kind or help someone specific. Fourth, vivid dreams, especially memorable dream imagery that seems meaningful. Fifth, desire for scripture, an irresistible draw to spend dedicated time in God's word. Throughout this message, I have highlighted each sign in greater detail. 
and encouraged you to be open and receptive whenever you notice any of them occurring. God delights in speaking directly to His children if we simply make space in our busy lives and believing minds. No sign is too small when viewed as a personalized message of love crafted by our Father in Heaven. Seek Him through every impression and experience with the expectancy of a child hoping to hear from their beloved Daddy. Like any devoted parent, God longs to commune intimately through whatever languages reach His children best. I pray this message has inspired you to heighten your spiritual awareness, strengthening your unique bond with God moment by moment, through every sign He chooses to use. Live each experience with wonder at His creativity and patience for ways to connect personally with you. Our loving Creator rejoices each chance you give to know Him through listening and responding to the individual ways He whispers in your heart. Thank Him for being a God who speaks and walk by faith in closer companionship each new day. While the road may have turns we cannot foresee, God promises to guide every step if we cooperate with His signs and follow wherever they lead. Though some messages may come in ways we don't yet understand, His perfect love casts out all doubt or fear when we fix our trust completely in Him. Friends, open your hearts now to the Divine Communicator for who He is, a good, good Father, loving beyond measure and perfectly able to make His plans clearly known. May each sign God gives increase your trust, intimacy and hope. This has been my prayer for you today. Let's close in prayer. Heavenly Father, we thank you for desiring close friendship with your precious children. You craft creative signs to gain each one's attention and pour personalized love over their unique lives. Help us learn to recognize your voice through every nudge of peace, open door impulse to serve, intriguing dream and powerful truth revealed in your word. Fill us with faith to see life's details as personalized messages of guidance, care and purpose from you. As we open our eyes to your signs all around, may our wonder grow for who you are, a Father who knows us completely and will never stop speaking love if we slow down to hear. Thank you for being a God who speaks directly to our hearts each new day. Embolden us with grace to respond, always in deeper obedience and understanding. May these common yet life-changing encounters with you become the highlight of each new sunrise. We love you our heavenly Abba. In Jesus' name, Amen.